This is the solar wall light. Hang out anywhere, fire shed, back wall, front wall, garage, wherever you need to have light. Opening up the product, I'm gonna show you how nicely it's packed. On top is your instruction guide. You use a manual about the product that you can go over online for further details. You get two hardware kits with four screws, four anchors. You get cable on each of the unit and you get the unit in white. As it has a solar panel, a PIR sensor, and an LED light, an on and off switch, and detachable solar panel by separating like so. In the box will be a remote control. Please remove the protective film to activate the remote. And in the other kit, you're gonna have your hangers for your solar panel and your solar light. If you take note of the PIR sensor, they're in red when light hits it to show a charge. Give you a nice close-up look at it when the sun hits the light for charge. And when it doesn't hit light, the light will go out and not charge. Place your bracket on. With your solar panel on to the top of the unit, lock into place correctly. With the cable, wrap up and tie down and adjust onto the bracket like so. Now that we had demonstrated and showed you how to install on the table, let me show you what it looks like outside, but before we do, we want to turn the unit on by the red button in the back. We want to show you the on and off and show you what mode one is about. Mode one, if you turn the unit on and hit mode one on, you get a low light on light 100% then full off until it detects motion. Going over the instructions, you have three modes. Mode one, turn on by motion triggering at night, turn off after 20 seconds of 100% brightness. On mode number two, turn on at night and stay on at low brightness till full brightness of motion detection for 20 seconds. And on mode three, turn on lasting six hours in darkness or night auto switch to mode one after six hours. So this will stay dim for six hours, then go to full motion mode number one after six full hours. So when we turn the unit on and hit mode number three, you see it blinks three times for you and goes into the dim mode for six full hours, then goes into a mode one, like so. And after 20 seconds, we'll turn off. At mode number two, blinks twice and goes into a 100% brightness and after 20 second dims down. We're gonna go place this one outside in a different area, show you what the one looks like up front. We have the light on, we're gonna leave it off, allow it to collect sun for a day and then come back and turn the unit on. So this way at nighttime, it would trigger on mode one. Pick a spot. Hang your unit. I'm gonna place this in the sun over there. We're all hooked up. Gonna shine the light down in the evening hours so when it collects sun, we're ready to show you what the three modes are at nighttime. As you notice, the light comes on, detects motion, stays on, and then shuts off after so many seconds. And that would be mode number one. In mode number two, it dims, detects motion, brightens up, and then dims down. Then of course we have motion number three, will be on the dim mode for six hours, then fully light 100%, with motion thereafter. And this is at a low level shot. 
We're going to go in the back and show you the light lighting up as well. We have the light lit up in the nighttime. It gives off a nice bright light and a nice radius. We are on mode number one. After so many seconds, it'll shut off. Mode number two and mode number three. Dust to dawn, six hours lit up. So if you're looking for a security PIR sensor that you can control from a distance or walk from a distance near and detect motion and light up your area, walking pets to light up the backyard and more, this product may be something that you are after. I hope you enjoy your product if this is what you are looking for in a security LED light system.